This is a promo video for our work Spectral Heterogeneous Graph Convolutions via Positive Non-Commutative Polynomials. This work has cooperated with my supervisor Professor Zhou Wei and a team from Baidu Incorporated. This work is focuses heterogeneous graphs, which has multiple types of loads and edges. These graphs are widespread in our lives. An example is the academic late work that includes three types of loads, papers, authors, and conference, and four types of edges, write, written by, published, and published by. At present, heterogeneous graph neural networks are the main method to deal with these heterogeneous graphs, but existing agents inhibit several limitations. Firstly, the efficiency of metapass based agents heavily relies on manually selected metapasses. Moreover, the design of aggregation strategies and the graph convolutions by these agents in the spatial domain is often heuristic, limiting their ability to non actual graph filters. Additionally, these agents obtain graph filters without unnecessary constraints, making them challenge to norm. So there is a natural question, how can we design our non-rational heterogeneous graph convolutions within the spectral domain? To address this issue, we first define the spectral heterogeneous graph convolution as a non commutative polynomial function of shift operators. The shift operators are multiple adjacency or Laplace matrices derived from the heterogeneous graph according to eight types. This method has been explored in graph signal processing, but such a naive deflation cannot guarantee the positive semi-differentness of graph filters. So we further propose the positive spectral heterogeneous graph convolution, which uses the sum of squares to deflect heterogeneous graph convolution, ensuring the positive semi-differentness of graph filters and proving its rationality from the perspective of graph optimization. This figure shows the graph convolution of our proposed positive spectral heterogeneous graph convolutional network called PSHGCN. In the experiment part, we first conduct the load classification experiment to evaluate the performance of PSHGCN compared to these baselines. PSHGCN got performance theme on our datasets. We then perform the link prediction on two datasets and the load classification on large graph map further demonstrating the ability for link prediction and scalability of PSHGC. That's all of my pretensions. Thank you.